How's it going guys? Trainer Tobes back with you for another video. Alright, so we're going to do something a little different today. Um, I am going to show you guys some couple things I've added to my collection. Um, and then we will open cards at the end of the video. Um, I'm mainly going to, I mean, I, I'm frequently adding new sets and stuff like that, but I'm going to try to show you guys some of the older stuff I've gotten. So, here's something we've opened on the channel, not this exact one, but... The same kind. This is a Charizard GX Hidden Fates tin. Um, it is from 2019. These typically go for around 70 80 bucks. Um, so yeah, they're good tins. Awesome. Um, this is going into my personal collection. It will never be opened. Um, the next thing I'm adding for my collection, I just got, is a Jolteon GX tin. I've actually never opened this. I don't know what's in it. It's from 2019 as well. I I don't know much about it, honestly. Um, I do want to... I probably am going to get another one to open up. But this one is going into my sealed collection, too. Um, but I am going to try to find another one. They're hard to find. Very hard to find. And they're not cheap. So, I don't expect anything super rare to be in them. I expect it all to be Sword and Shield era. Maybe... Maybe there's four booster packs in it. Maybe one sudden Sun and Moon or two Sun and Moon packs and then two Sword and Shield Era packs. I really don't know. So I am excited to add this one. Jolteon's one of my favorite Pokemon, so I was excited to get one of these. Alright, so then I've added some other new things from the new new sets and stuff. So nothing crazy there. So what we are gonna do though, we are gonna open up a couple packs now. So <laughs> Excuse me. All right. So I have three Lost Origins packs I'm going to open up here for you. And we're going to open up a Swamp Hurt. Um, Check Lane Blister. Uh, and this should be Astral Radiance. Yeah, Astral Radiance. Um, we're going to do this first, actually. I did add a few of these to my collection too. So I'm probably going to do this like once a week or once every other week or so. Um, and if you guys like it, let me know. I'll keep doing it. If you guys don't like it, don't care what I add to my collection, that's fine too. Then I won't do it. Alright, so I just drop everything out. Alright, we got that coin. It's a nice coin. Let me get this card that I just dropped. Right, and of course I swap drop the hollow. So you have of course Mudkip, which is the first form of the evolution. Alright. Marsh Stomp. I can always I always have trouble saying that. And then Swampert. Right. So these are just regular cards. They're not like anything special or anything, they're just part of the set. Um but you're guaranteed them when you buy the checkling blister, right? So without any further ado, we're gonna open extra radiance. Let's see if we can get a hit. Um, I have a really cool video I have coming up for you guys. Um, it's not filmed yet. It'll be filmed on Saturday, I believe. I will be filming this. But it won't be out until Sunday or Monday, probably. But it's a really cool video. Um, let's just say I won't be alone for this video. So I'm excited to see how it goes. We'll be trying something new. So, you know, give you guys thoughts. Into, what, into a Hisuian Sneasler V. All right, so we did get a hit out of that. So there you go, that's nice. Um, so check lane blisters typically go for about $4.99. That's how much I got this one for. Um, so. All right, now on to Lost Origins. Of course, the newest set just released. It's only about five days old now. So, brand spanking new. Oh, sorry guys. My bad. All right, so. Oh, 
Rosalia Reverse into a Zorark V. Or V. <laughs> Zorark Hollow hit. Nothing crazy there. Let's see if we can keep the magic going. So let me know. Have you guys opened Lost Origin yet? And if you have, have you guys gotten anything good out of it yet? Um, let me know down in the comment section what you got. Or if you've opened it, just a simple yes or no. And if, if you have... What is your guys, if you guys know, what's your chase card in this set? Mine would probably be the Alt Art Aerodactyl. I mean, it's probably one of the best cards in the set. Really? Like, really? Seriously? The same exact hollow? What are the odds of that? Alright, well, there you go, guys. That's the easiest card to pull in the set, I guess. No, not really. But, I mean, seriously, what are the odds? Of the three packs I picked up, what are the odds? Because these were all bought at the same time. So what are the odds of being the same? Now we pull a third one out. I'm just assuming every pack in there has that hollow in it. Hopefully we can get a hit. Well, we do have a hit because I saw the code card. So I know we at least have a hollow. Maybe we can get a double pack. Saru, Paris, Ink, okay. and we Ink okay, reverse into ooh a Delphox V, nice. It's a nice card. Sorry guys. Alright guys, so that's going to do it for the video. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys want to see more stuff like this every so often. Won't be, you know, every day or anything like that. Probably be once to twice a week. Once to every other week. Um, and let me know what you guys think. Hit that like button, comment down in the video. Let me know if you like it. And I will see you guys on the next video.